We've gotten some super interesting leaks from Star Citizen Alpha 3.24. This is going to be a long one. Let's talk. Before I get into the video, I'd like to let y'all know that I'm doing a giveaway for the Drake Cutter. In order to participate, all you have to do is be subscribed and leave a comment in any video today. Today's the last day, all right? So make sure you're subscribed and leave a comment in any video, okay? Let's get straight into this video. All right, guys, um, huge shout out to the Pipeline Discord channel. What's it, what had happened was um, there is a game.dcb file that was hard to um, crack and they, the Pipeline Discord channel managed to crack this file. And um, after doing this, it revealed tons and tons of new information pertaining to what we're gonna get in the future. It starts in level 4.0 uh, or even 3.24 and beyond. So this is a lot. So buckle your seat belts, all right? So um, right now, these are being leaked right now. So information is just constantly being added on the channel right now so i'm just going to be going through them and reacting um with you as i go through it okay so um the very first one that is mentioned here is uh more information pertaining to the misfortune so we already spoke about that this is going to be a salvager um so this is no this is not really news but what they did find is the xml records of it uh, pertaining to all the components all the parts the ship uh cargo lift um you know all aspects of the ship all the components and everything okay so um these ones are not new to us since we've covered it in the previous uh video so let me just scroll down here all right um it seems like uh some new quantum some power supplies i guess different power supply quantum drive cooler names um one is uh for for power is it says Trommel. uh quantum is a goliath snowfall for cooler so these are different i'm not gonna go through this actually um so let's go down as we go through this okay so up next here um the gray cat the gray cat cav and gray cat uh csv so we got some more information pertaining to those and uh, the very first one here is pertaining to the CAB. It says that the CAB has a missile rack parameter in the XML file for it. Um, so that's interesting. So this is going to be a vehicle that has a missile launcher associated with it. Very, very interesting. Um, so now, now regarding the Grey Cat uh, CSV, it's a cargo vehicle, it looks like. Um, it has um, seat access, uh, wheel, cargo, it has wheel, it has wheel, is this a ground vehicle? It has doors, uh, lights, energy, cooler, comms, shield, um, weapon, okay, capacitor assignment, okay, okay, let's see here, radar it has, okay life support it has life support okay that's that's kind of expected me for a ground vehicle hmm it even has a relay um slot there okay so engineering gameplay is even going to work on this vehicle all right so now the interesting piece here is it has um cargo rack on the top it says cargo rack top so and it has a roof cap so possibly an entry point from the roof as well this is an interesting vehicle what is i'm really curious what this thing, this thing is really about it has an entrance hatch okay um then it also has cargo grid cargo main cargo grid cargo rare and uh, cargo grid template it says here i'm just reading through the xml files and trying to get out the most uh, important pieces another one that's super interesting is it seems like a starter ship that's coming it's going to be the crusader interpit now i think we heard about this earlier um it was leaked a while back and it seems like they've got more information so it seems like this is going to be a starter ship okay so um reading through the xml files it has a few hard points here left uh cargo door left cargo door right uh, missile rack left missile rack right so okay it seems like it's going to be a sizable starter ship um 
weapon main entrance ramp it has entrance ramp all right um fuel ground and then there's fuel port that's interesting different two different ways of refueling this thing that's interesting um headlights left and right okay entrance door and engineering screen interesting okay um it has a entrance ramp and entrance cargo so two entrances for this vehicle so far interesting okay so then they have a list of the components i'm not really gonna read them here i don't think these are too significant it has a cargo lift i think we already said that um, but it seems like it has cargo lift and uh let's see let's see here uh, crusader engine pit cargo lift entrance ramp and ground fuel port are all in the xmls for this thing interesting 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 all right so let's continue on the next one is the misc star lancer <laughs> this is crazy i never heard of anything like this the misc star lancer looks like uh it has a cargo grid all right um and it's a exploration vehicle the misc star lancer is an exploration vehicle it says here vehicle focus exploration all right that's interesting it has drone seat so this thing is an exploration vehicle that has drones so this gives us more information um that exploration is going to um require drone at least has drones as an option uh for exploration so exploration drones that's going to be interesting i'm really curious to see how that gameplay is going to play out so it says drone seat docking tube okay elevator base platform front lift grid nice 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 miss star lancer max so that's what it's going to be called i think it's going to be the misc star lancer max so this is probably a, a variant of it maybe it has an entrance ramp airlock and a cargo so maybe a cargo ramp as well maybe i'm not too sure what that means all right and then um it has a few loadouts i think it has size two components based on the the numbering here um it seems like it has two power plants size two power plants um one quantum drive two size two coolers a size two uh radar a size three shield generator so it's going to be a bit tanky okay and uh it has dual gimbals as well for weaponry pilot guns is going to be two size four so two size four for the pilot and they're going to be gimbaled interesting and it also says it's two times misc uh star lancer remote turret so two remote turrets and those remote turrets have size four repeaters this thing is going to be a sizable ship a sizable exploration ship this thing is going to be is this going to be in the same class as the odyssey and the carrick or maybe one size down from that this th this thing it seems like it's going to be a big ship man okay 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 all right so continue on um four missile racks size fours um drone seats um cargo grid left and right and um i'm not sure what that is comfort air plus not sure what that is okay so um star lancer max yeah all right let's see let's see let's see we've already, we've already seen that we've already seen that all right just trying to find the most the most important pieces to to give you guys co-pilot seat drone seat pilot access um access support seat access support seat access support left and right all right so now uh moving on so next it says uh some files pertaining to crafting okay so some crafting so it looks like we're going to be getting some more crafting gameplay it looks like looking at this just trying to see if there's anything um that i can um extrapolate from this salvage for the station 
Okay. Receipt and munition. Grey Cat Multi Tool Resource Salvage Repair. Okay. Salvage Repair. So I think this is just a, a vehicle that will be crafting all the various um, pieces. I think salvage vehicles. Salvage vehicles already have uh, the terminal where you can you can print out uh, based on the material you have. Um, so that's what this is. So it looks like it might be a new vehicle that will be doing this. It seems like. Okay. All right. So let's continue on. Creatures. It seems like uh, they found something called Alloprat. Simple Boyd. Condor. Fish. Capelin. Koi. Storm. Wall. Vindel. They got quite a few. Um, creatures that they're working on it looks like this is going to be interesting all right voids um yeah they have a few void xmls as well okay all right let's continue base building stuff okay interesting um storage chest large template okay so storage chest and then they have medium and they have small man this is gonna be crazy man store chess I'm, I'm really excited for base building it's gonna be interesting okay all right so now they have recipe parts they have recipe parts for crafting so we're gonna be getting a lot of crafting i think this is gonna be coming with the base building stuff where we're gonna need to craft certain things uh, in order to build up our bases and um this is interesting so i'm just gonna quickly read through some of the recipes here um it says Bantam reactor, um, core modulator, um, dame man multiplier or something like that, um, distortion, discharger, um, emihancer, incubator, uh, energy diode, field capacitor, a uh, hello cylinder, heat processor, um, heat siphon, uh, payload shell, plating, generic plating, uh, propulsor, Q cell, what is that? Quantum regulator, um, receipt parts. Quantum regulator and Q cell, these are probably like various components to build a quantum drive. It seems like, right? Just based on this, so we'll be able to craft our own components for our ships that's gonna be pretty cool to do okay all right um ripley coil um, rotary drum uh strike uh striking pin uh tempered plating tempered plating um, thermal dam uh tracking sensor trajectory stabilizer transformer interesting so crafting is going to be something that we're going to be seeing soon this is really exciting it's really exciting stuff man this is a big leak here all right so let's continue on room system okay so um extinguisher help fire filter fire igniter fire prototype and fire repair helper so maybe these are um, various, uh, you know, on your screen, the helper, the, the, the little thing that comes on the bottom, right? That gives you like pointers when like you have like your multi-tool out, just gives you pointers on how to use it and things like that. Seems like that's what this is about. All right. So it says salvageable. Um, I guess this is salvage stuff. Nothing new here. Shipping container pyro heist it says here so it looks like pyro may be getting a heist mission pertaining to shipping containers so that's gonna be interesting okay 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 all right up next it says um astral clearing control elimination so different mission types for different outposts it says here uh fps kill confirm these might be yeah these looks like a reading commander yeah, because it says EA. So it looks like they're going to be adding some uh, different game types um, for different arena commanders. So 
Uh, so Claren is going to be a new map, it seems like. Uh, Gundo is also going to be new. Crossroad is going to be new, it looks like. Um, Cryastro. A location on Daymar. A location on Monarchs. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. All right, next here, it says gas composite template, Odin. Atmosphere, Odin. Are there gonna be gases in the, in the, in the Odin? I think Odin is a system, right? Odin is a system, it's not a planet. Okay. All right, so up next, Moby Glass. It says S42 prototype. Hmm. personal status uh so i guess this is just moby glass stuff like your personal statuses and uh skill and attributes uh selected weapons uh selected technique so that means i guess select technique this is under the skill category by the way so it looks like maybe like takedowns and and stuff like that maybe you get to select a certain way you, want, you can take down characters that's what i'm getting from this there's different uh, missions here. I'm not gonna name them, name through them. I don't wanna spoil too much on Squadron, but uh, but it's interesting that it's in it's in the Star Citizen build and not Squadron, and uh, that's interesting. It looks like they, they brought over a few things over from uh, S42 over to Star Citizen. Okay, so now hacking, interesting. So it's hacking agent, hacking board. Um, hmm. we've seen a little bit about hacking and, and these this seems like uh, some of the same things that we've seen in, in, I think like well over a year ago we've seen this um, nodes, link ports, um, paths and these are things that we've seen with the hacking gameplay that they showed us a while back walls, corner, crossing straight, junctions and, and things like that door docking legionnaire so now the legionnaire is in okay okay the legionnaire is an xml file for door docking pertaining to hacking okay cheesecake terminal not sure what that means <laughs> what what is a cheesecake terminal uh in relation to hacking i'm not sure what that is all right so let's continue paint color logo so i guess they have different logos um and different paint colors oh i guess different colors uh dif different skins i think these are going to be different skins for various ships including the zeus starlifters spirit series uh lightning freelancer um the cutter yeah the csv which is the gray cat it's gonna have some skins. Interesting. Constellation, Caterpillars, Aurora, and the 890 Jump are gonna be having some skins. So that's interesting. All right, so now it says here, new Arena Commander game mode. Seems to be possibly Helldivers like. Really? So it says it's Apex uh, VLKAIP. Uh, profile so it says mission it looks like it's going to be taking place i guess the name is going to be called apex and it's going to take place on monarchs so that's going to be one of the moons monarchs and daymar so one of the moons in pyro and uh, one of the planets in pyro and daymar itself it seems like uh two different locations for a command that's gonna be interesting that's gonna be interesting all right, so next here, let's see if we can, can we, are these two separate? All right, so FPS, ammo, particle tracers, bearing rifle, ballistics. Uh, let's see if there's anything interesting here. The vault LMG, the vault pistol, vault rifle, vault shotgun, vault SMG, vault sniper. That's interesting. I can't wait to see the vault, vault guns in game, man. It's, it's just been so long. Kegar, FE igniter. I guess a thermal gun. There's going to be a thermal gun. 
GLS GLSN rifle. Not sure what that is. Um, PRAR pistol, which is going to be energy and TOG. TOAG special ballistic. That's interesting. And then there's VLK spew gun. A spew gun? Interesting. Man, they're cooking up some new ideas, man. All right, next, let's see here what we have here. Um, Titan suit. Combat. It looks like they, they have a Titan, a combat Titan suit, okay? In the XMLs. Um, hmm. Ground vehicle. nothing interesting here okay so let's continue um creatures bespoke says foley creature says uh i guess val valet car apex movement so this might be the worms that i think we've seen last time right this might also be maybe in pyro not sure um also, they also have uh, possibly some contested zones that they found here for Pyro. Um, and then I guess they have different grades. Uh, grade B being rare, grade C being uncommon, grade D being common, and loose is drug. So I guess different things we can find or as rewards in the contested zones. I guess that's interesting. All right, so that seems to be it for now. Um, just to let y'all know, all of this is leaks, right? So this could be stuff that we could be seeing soon. Could be stuff that we could be seeing further down the line. Could be stuff that they may just outright remove, and it was just an idea. So everything in this video, make sure you take it with a grain of salt. This was interesting to find all this new stuff that cig is working on super exciting stuff you guys let me know what did you find the most exciting in this video before i let you go i'd like to let y'all know that my organization phase one industries now recruiting new and better employers if you are interested you can find our discord in the description down below don't forget to leave the like subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one